Got some more free stuff in the mail. Let's see what we got. Some sunglasses. Oh, salt and pepper grinder shaker things. And a cushion for my butt. All right, we'll start with the glasses. They came in this soft case here and just this piece of plastic. And so when I put them on, I was like, it feels weird. And I looked at it and they were slightly bent, like, you know, they're twisted a little bit. And then I took a little closer look and ever so slightly, the nose piece one's higher than the other. And I think you can see it right there. I mean, granted these are 11, $12 glasses, thin, flimsy metal. If you're just going for the look, you know, that's cool. But at the same time, you still expect things to be lined up and not slightly twisted. So I bent it back and I'm out goofing around. The cushion is for people with back problems, butt problems, whatever, and I'm fortunate enough to have uh, a broken back. I have a, a spondy grade two. My spine is almost halfway off and I deal with a lot of back pain. So I'm kind of interested to see if this helps alleviate some of that pain uh, above my tailbone and, and in that area. That's something I'm got to try to test out. The next item, these salt and pepper shakers, comes with a fancy toothbrush. There's the grinder. It's got a nice little lid and so you can grind it. But also notice that if you unscrew it, you can fill up your salt and pepper really easy. And there have been some salt and pepper grinders that I could not figure out how to open it. And I started, I think we have one that's cracked. Maybe we got rid of it. This looks nice. They have a simple way to refill your salt and pepper. Now, I don't know if if you're turning the grinder and it jams up, if it'll start to unturn, uh, that is something that may be a problem, may not be a problem, but something to uh, consider. And then it comes with a, what's it, a cheese slicer. It's got lots of little grooves in it. It's to help you refill it. It's a little uh, collapsible funnel, which is kind of cool. It may have more uses than just that. Oh, so one way you turn it is fine, the other way you turn it is coarse. It actually helps a little bit. Now, granted, that was only for like a minute. I'm gonna keep testing it and see if it really helps my back. No. Course. And fine. We also got a nice feature here. Like most grinders, you can tighten and loosen this to get a finer or more coarse uh, serving as you grind it. And they come with lids. What more do you want? Okay, so this is memory foam. Kind of has that soft soft type memory foam type feel. Through one through ten, if my back pain's between a four and a six most of the time, it feels like when I sit on this, it drops one point. So I'm looking at a three to five in the pain just by having this little memory foam. And I get that everyone's back problem is different. Like I say, my spine is like this. I'll probably link a picture in the video. And also, if you got a hard seat, it just adds a little comfort to it. You got a little hole here for your tailbone and everything not to take all the pressure off of that, which is nice, because for some reason my tailbone's been hurting. That's one of the reasons I asked for this product.